You know, our weather team has been mentioning that there's some rain chances in the forecast, but you know that drought is not going away anytime soon. That rain would be very good news. The National yeah. Weather Service says, though, in the meantime, this drought only getting worse. First one five meteorologist Cecilia Gutierrez explains it's getting as bad as it did seven years ago. Everywhere you look, you can see signs of the drought. For dry land crop growers, it's a real problem because dry land crops require irrigation to get them started and to get them going. Uh, some of them do not need as much water during the full growing season, but to start them off, they do. Field after field, this is the norm. Take a look at the drought monitor. All of Star County is in extreme drought. The rest of the valley is in the severe category. Several factors go into the drought monitor's levels. It does look at season. It looks at evaporation. It kind of looks at those things in the 90 day hole, but it's really looking at precipitation. After all, it's a precipitation index. Barry Goldsmith says it's probably going to get worse before it gets better. It would not surprise at all to see part, if not all, of the valley ultimately go into uh, extreme drought, which is level three, the, the second highest level, with evaporation rates being high, with the lean of the pattern towards drier than wetter, um, we're pretty confident that not only does the drought persist, but the level of drought will continue to worsen. The last time the valley saw dry conditions like this was in 2013. September 3rd, 2013. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so exceptional drought, the worst level in the Mid Valley. Goldsmith says rain chances in April and May will play a huge factor in the drought levels. There needs to be several rounds of heavy rain for the drought levels to get better. In Westlake, Cecilio Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.